in the 90s, Brilliant, mate. even in the early 2000s, you go imagine, out and once you're out, you're out. I was about 15, 16 maybe. And I was getting a train from Brentwood to Romford to meet my mates to go to Hollywoods. And the train was delayed at Brentwood. So I was supposed to meet him, same kind of thing, supposed to meet him at 8 o'clock. Anyway, 8.45, they go to a payphone and they call my home, right? And my mum picks it up and, and they say, oh, we're, we're waiting for Ed, but he ain't turned up, right? We were supposed to be here at 8, it's now 8.45. They're thinking, well, we dropped him at the station at quarter past seven. So what's going on? Anyway, the train was delayed. Eventually, 9 o'clock, I turned up, met the boys. We're in the queue at Hollywoods, right? And I'm memorising the date of birth to, to say that I'm 18, just in yeah, case, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. what's the date of birth? <laughs> and then all of a sudden, my mate goes to me, is that your old man? <laughs> Look to my left, and he, had, he used to have a white Merc, when it, and the number plate was the 147s. And he's got out, and he's in, he's in his pyjamas, right? And he's going... <laughs> up and down the queue, right? And I've run over and I've gone, Baza, fuck off, will you? And he went, Oh, your mum was worried about you. The, the boys' phone say you never turned up. I went, fuck off, you know. <laughs> but back then, that's what it was like. And it was, it was mad to think that you would just say, Cheerio. Yeah. You know I mean? 